The referees have been running wild this NFL season. Like there was a time where the refs cost the team the game and led the refs losing their jobs. It all went down with Detroit Lions, drilling by just one point with little time left. Instead of playing it safe and tying the game, they went all in with a trick play for a two-point conversion. Surprisingly, they succeeded and the stadium went wild. But wait, a sudden twist. The refs threw a flag claiming the play was illegal. They argued that the guy who caught the ball, Taylor Decker, was an offensive lineman and shouldn't have caught passes without informing them beforehand. Replays suggested he did, but the ref wasn't buying it. The game-winning moment was annulled and chaos ensued. The Lions' coach was losing his mind on the sidelines. What's even crazier, fans were blaming the players, but the NFL took a stand. The ref and his crew were fired and they were banned from officiating the upcoming playoffs. Justice was served, but the whole situation was as confusing as a magic show gone wrong. But as crazy as this call was, it just keeps getting worse. Like what if I was able to tell you there was a catch that seemed like pure magic was ruled in favor of a team even though the ball looked like it was flirting with the ground. To make things more absurd, it all happened on Christmas Eve and the refs gifted a call that left everyone scratching their heads. The catch was so close to being out of bounds that the team threw a red flag challenging the ruling. But wait, there's more drama. As they zoomed in, it turned out the player was juggling the ball like a circus act and his foot never touched the ground until the ball did. Basic math, ball plus ground equals no catch, right? And even the commentator questioned the referee's decision. Everyone, including the commentators, ultimately thought it was an incomplete pass. But guess what? The ref's verdict? The ruling on the field stands first down. And just when you thought one bad call wasn't a big deal, the ref struck again. This time handling the team a win with a 32-yard field goal. Referees are not just game spoilers, but they are giving away free points too. Referees play a role beyond just ruining games or causing chaos, but what's even more mind-boggling is when the refs make a call on something that never even happened. Imagine that, a call based on pure imagination. Usually, I wouldn't believe it, but anything seems possible with the refs in the wacky football officiating world. Amari Cooper catches the pass and stays within bounds, and even the referee is eyeballing the action. It seems like a no-brainer. How could they mess this up? But wait for it, the officials call him out of bounds even though he was practically a stone's throw away from the line. Amari, the player himself, knew he got robbed of a touchdown and he wasn't shy about it. Surprisingly, the ref admitted the mistake after watching the replay. Can you believe it? A referee apologizing? But hold up, if that happened to you, would you just brush it off? Not a chance. It's like a plot twist in a crazy sports drama. Touchdown denied, apologies offered, but the frustration lingers like a sour aftertaste. But just when you thought one bad call wasn't enough, the referees decided to spice things up. Like there was a time the refs gave a team free points. Like, bro, what are you doing? A ref, seemingly lost in the play, ends up tripping a player who's heading into the end zone. It's like a bizarre dance move gone wrong right in front of Lamar Jackson. Now, here's where it gets wild. Not only did the ref cause a player to fall in the end zone, but it turned into a safety, giving the other team two free points. You heard it right, folks. Free points are handed out like candy for a tripping ref. But hold up, there was an even crazier situation when the referees made three enormous calls during the same play, ultimately costing the Vikings an L. In a crucial play, the refs threw a yellow flag for pass interference, making the right call for once, or so we thought. The referee's jersey was getting a hands-on experience before he even had the ball, an easy pass interference call. Now, here's where it gets wild. The commentators debated the throw itself, thinking it could have avoided flags if tipped. But nope, the tip happened. Plus, there were more potential penalties. Chiefs grabbing face mask and taking helmets off, a referee's nightmare. But guess what? After a brief ref powwow, they decided to change their minds and pick up the flag. No foul for pass interference, they claimed, despite the blatant evidence. The refs were in a cloud of confusion, smoking something mysterious. And this ridiculous call gave the Chiefs the ball and led them to victory. 
Now, that's football madness. But y'all, I'm going to keep it real. You haven't seen nothing compared to the refs ruining one of the greatest plays in history. Travis Kelsey pulls off a mind-blowing play, catching a pass, gracefully navigating through defenders, and wait for it, transforming it to the quarterback himself, leading to an absolute touchdown spectacle. But the referees, in a rare instance of paying attention to the fine print, decided to throw a curveball into the mix. Kadarius Tony, ever so slightly over the line before the play kicked off, gets hit with an offside penalty. Now, here's where it gets wild, folks. Players often flirt with the line and it rarely gets called. But for some reason, the refs chose this moment to be sticklers for the rules. Social media exploded with memes and jokes suggesting Tony was over the line, like waiting impatiently in traffic or looking back at Mahomes when he was offside. The internet was in a frenzy, expressing frustration at how a minor detail overshadows such a legendary moment. Speaking of frustration, Patrick Mahomes himself wasn't having it. After the game, he unleashed his anger by smashing his helmet and passionately expressing his disbelief at the referees. In Mahomes' eyes, this play wasn't just good. It was worthy of the Hall of Fame. The refs, usually the game's background characters, managed to steal the spotlight for all the wrong reasons. They turned the moment of sheer brilliance into a confusing mess, leaving football fans scratching their heads and wondering, what if the refs just let greatness be? The drama continues on the unpredictable stage of NFL officiating. In the case of Travis Kelsey's epic play, has it turned into an oops moment? How did a minor detail overshadow a legendary moment? And how did it affect the perception of the play and the game? Let us know in the comments below. Thanks for tuning in in today's video. If you enjoyed what you saw, don't forget to hit the like button and ring the notification bell so you never miss out on our upcoming videos. Your support means a lot to us. Take care until the next one and feel free to drop a comment sharing your thoughts. See you soon.